Gaming Bowl presents Top 8 Upcoming Games in September 2015. August is nearly at an end and presented a decent roster of high-profile games to choose from. However, September is where the real AAA season begins and it's full of high-profile remasters, long-awaited sequels, innovative titles, big-name expansions, and even a football game or two. Please note that this list is in random order. With that out of the way, what are some of the top upcoming games to look forward to in September 2015? Number 8. Destiny The Taken King Enough has been said for both for and against Bungie's online shooter Destiny. It's credit enough that it's able to stay in the news so often, but whether you feel slighted by many Year 1 exotics being left behind, or that whole deal behind Year 1 rewards, The Taken King will be Destiny's most substantial expansion to date. A new zone, loads of new gear and weapons, a new leveling system, and much more are on the way, but will it be enough to sway an additional $40 away from consumers' wallets? Number 7. Mad Max Avalanche Software is best known for its chaos and over-the-top violence of its Just Cause series. With Mad Max, it takes a decidedly different approach, mixing open-world exploration with realistic brawling and visceral car combat. The game itself is very true to the aesthetic of the Mad Max universe and the appearance of various areas we love like Thunderdome, Gastown, and more. Along with the developer's pedigree to make it worth watching out for, Mad Max is out on September 1st for the Xbox One, PC, and PS4. Number 6, Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain This is the big one, with nearly perfect critical acclaim from all fronts, an immense budget, and as the conclusion to the saga started with Ground Zeroes and the overarching Metal Gear timeline, Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain is nearly upon us. Whether you're looking to get into the series for the first time, eager to explore and dissect the story bit by bit, or just in the mood to experience what could be the best game of the year, The Phantom Pain simply can't be missed. Unless, of course, you want to play Mad Max first since they released it on the same day. Number 5, Forza Motorsport 6. Though Forza Motorsport has always been about celebrating the wondrous engineering of automobiles, Forza Motorsport 5 seemed to lack a tremendous selection of cars. Forza Motorsport 6 fixes this by offering more than 450 cars, a myriad of tracks to choose from, and even better visuals than before. Drivatar returns to taunt players once again, and the new Stories of Motorsport mode looks to offer the meanest single-player mode in the series. Couple that with up to 24 racers on the track at once, wet weather driving, and commentary from former Top Gear host James May and Richard Hammond, and Forza Motorsport 6 is pretty much the racer to look forward to. Number 4, FIFA 16. I'm not a football guy at all at all. However, EA's FIFA series is a big deal and FIFA 16 appears to be its biggest step forward yet. Along with the unusual enhancements and changes, such as training being moved to career mode and skill games to further tailor your players, FIFA 16 will be the first game in the series to include female teams. Twelve women's national teams have been included along with detailed motion capture for female footballers. If it's all about the atmosphere, then you'll have 78 stadiums to choose from, with crowds acting more vibrant than ever. FIFA 16 is out on September 22nd in North America and September 24th in Europe. Number 3, Super Mario Maker. Nintendo Super Mario Maker is going beyond simply giving fans the next big Mario platformer. It's now allowing them to create their own. Using the art styles and assets from Super Mario Bros, Super Mario Bros 3, Super Mario World, and Super Mario Bros U, you can create your own Mario level, complete with classic items and obstacles. Players can also manipulate elements accordingly, adding more enemies, mixing up level layouts entirely, and then sharing these levels online. For those more interested in playing than creating, there's the online course world which provides access to various user-created levels along with challenges. Super Mario Maker is out on September 11th in North America and Europe. Number 2, Tearaway Unfolded. Yes, this is another port remaster for the PlayStation 4, but guess what? The original Tearaway is one of the best PS Vita titles, and Media Molecule will be effectively retelling its story on the PS4 with Tearaway Unfolded. The various features have been redesigned and enhanced for the DualShock 4 controller, and an extended storyline has also been promised. If that weren't enough, the game will be in 1080p resolution and running at 60 frames per second. Tearaway Unfolded is out on September 8th. Number 1, Soma. What exactly has Frictional Games, developer of the amazing Amnesia The Dark Descent, been up to anyway? As it turns out, the newest game Soma has been in development since 2010. Not many details have been revealed aside from the first-person survival horror tapping, sci-fi elements, and eerie otherworldly creatures that have been tested thus far. But given the brilliance the studio delivered with Amnesia, it seems a given that Soma will be something truly special. Look forward to it on September 22nd for PS4, PC, Mac OS X, and Linux. What game are you looking forward to in September? If you like this video, why not subscribe? We have awesome videos frequently and every week. Stay tuned for more. Till then, stay tight, bros.